Good morning. We are, Tony and I, Tony's right there. We are south of Willow Beach. That's all we're gonna say. Sun's coming up around the river. I'm sure anybody that's in the crew can figure out where we are, but I'm not saying. It's glass. It's very seldom like this down here. But we're gonna try and uh, catch something. Bigger fish than Lake Mead. Smaller fish than Willow, but still good. So stick around, might be interesting. Okay, we got a little plane action circling us here. Not something you see every day. But he's coming back. I don't know if he's looking for something. I don't know what he's doing, but that's that's kind of strange. He's mighty low. I do hope you see me. Are you gonna land? For reals? This dude's gonna land. Well, he's just gonna scare the fish away. All right, so we're four hours into this and I don't have anything yet. I got a couple bumps. Tony's got a couple of smallmouth. I keep seeing balls of shad like that right here, which is right where they should be, right where I thought they'd be, but I figured they'd be boiling over here. So I don't know if they're going to boil or if I'm going to catch anything. But uh, I'm going to pull into a cove up here and throw an Ed rig, bounce an Ed rig off the bottom. That's a sure skunk killer right there, hopefully. But if not, I well, you know, it just might not be meant to be today. After a very long time, four hours, I'm on. Them. Got two lines out, so this is going to be a bit of a trick. does not feel like he is small either. You should never know with these river stripers. He's a good one. And I have managed to get both lines. That is awesome. Oh no.
This is why you don't run freaking two lines. Got it. All right. Now then. Choked it. He did. There he is. That's about a five pounder. Okay, number two. Yeah. <laughs> Hooked it right in front of that cove where you said all the shad were. Yep. I say go back down and then. Whoa, now he. <laughs> you see this pole, it's doing that too. Holy moly. Oh. Jeez, a -loo, look at that thing. That was close. This could be a new personal bass right here. Down the water. No, it's fine. Oh, okay. They're on a Okay, it's 10 to 10, and Tony's already pulled in. Tony's in a little bit of pain today, and I gave him the five pounder that I caught, and I tried to revive this guy, seven and a quarter pounds, and he just wants to come with me, so he wouldn't swim away. So that's pretty much a wrap for this one, unless something happens over here, which has been known to happen. Um, like I told Tony, I have always caught more non-boiling stripers than I ever catch out of boils. And there was no boils today. And I got a five and a seven and a quarter pounder. So, that's pretty much it. So if you like what you saw, this is not pretty right here. If you like what you saw, like and subscribe. There will always be more. I try to keep it interesting. Sometimes I'm not successful. But, you know, I do what I can. So, see you next time. Thanks for watching.